Hello and welcome back to Contra Crime Chronicles, the channel where we dive headfirst into the most shocking true crime stories that demand justice and awareness. Today, we bring you a heart-wrenching incident that has shaken the medical community in Bhopal, India. This story is about the tragic suicide of Dr. Bala Saraswati, who was a junior resident at Gandhi Medical College. What's even more tragic, is that, Dr. Saraswati becomes the second female doctor to die by suicide at Bhopal's Gandhi Medical College. In January 2023, 24-year-old Dr. Akanksha Maheshwari, a junior resident in pediatrics, committed suicide by an overdose of anesthesia and painkillers through injection. Her reason? An overwork schedule combined with humiliation and harassment from the senior doctors in her department. So this isn't just a case of suicide, it's a disturbing story of alleged ragging and relentless pressure, faced by medical students in Indian universities, and it becomes even more tragic as Dr. Surasvati was 14 weeks pregnant. As we uncover the details of this distressing event, let us remember that true crime stories like these not only expose the darker side of society, but also urge us to stand up against injustice and demand change. Viewer discretion is advised as we explore the sensitive nature of this case. On July 31, 2023, the young life of Dr. Bala Surasvati, a 27-year-old gynecology resident, tragically came to an end. Her family claims that, she was pressured and humiliated by senior doctors in her department, pushing her into a deep state of depression. The events leading up to this tragedy, unfolded the previous day, a Sunday, which is a day of rest for many. But for Dr. Surasvati, it was a day that she was called back to the hospital, for a non-stop 36-hour shift, all while carrying the precious life of her 14-week unborn child. Ragging or hazing in medical universities, is a problem that has long plagued the system in India. Dr. Surasvati's family reveals that, she was continuously taunted and labeled as a slacker, by her seniors, causing her immense stress and humiliation. As the pressure mounted, her thesis faced rejection, and her request for a medical leave during the early stages of her pregnancy was denied. This lack of support left Dr. Surasvati feeling overwhelmed and unsupported in her crucial time of need, not only as a medical professional but also as an expectant mother. In her final moments, Dr. Bala Surasvati penned a heart-wrenching suicide note, expressing her love and gratitude to her family, but also holding three senior doctors of gynecology department responsible for her death. The grieving family and friends, gathered at Gandhi Medical College, demanding justice for Dr. Surasvati and her unborn child. In response to this tragic event, all of the 52 junior doctors in the gynecology department initiated a strike, demanding accountability and justice. The suicide of Dr. Surasvati, shines a harsh light on the culture of ragging and intense pressure faced by medical students not just in Bhopal but all over India. And as we advocate for justice in this case, let us also work towards creating a healthier and more empathetic learning environment for future medical students. Thank you for joining us on Contra Crime Chronicles. If you found this story important, please share it to raise awareness about the issue of ragging and the mental health challenges faced by young doctors in India. Remember to subscribe for more true crime content. Until next time, stay watchful and demand justice for those who cannot speak for themselves.